everyone welcome to low carb crazy i am diane if you're new to my channel welcome uh for all of the rest of you guys that have been with me uh hi dwellers how are you i hope all is well with you guys as you know today is the last and final weigh-in for my three-day egg fast that i did the last three days and um if you want to see what happened don't move So just to recap, each day I um, ate deviled eggs for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Um, and I ate as many as I wanted to. I wasn't sure about how much to eat because this is something I don't think anybody's ever done before. I like had four or five for breakfast or even six at one point. And, um, lunch and dinner just how much i felt like eating but i had three meals of the same thing and um for for breakfast i did add a coffee with with real heavy whipping cream and uh stevia so i did do that um and just a tiny bit of uh, the sugar-free coffee milk that i love yeah and then i just had some peppermint tea uh with stevia at night also some like seltzer water and things like that that had no sugar I ate almost a dozen eggs a day. It was it was anywhere between nine and 11 eggs a day. I actually didn't really count it out, but I know it was close to a dozen because the last two nights I had to make more deviled eggs. So that tells you I ate a lot of deviled eggs, <laughs> like especially the first two days because I was hungry. But yesterday I ate a lot less and I'll tell you what happened. A lot of people uh, asked me on my first couple of egg fasts I did, the egg fast videos, I get a lot of comments asking, Oh boy, you know, did you get a lot of terrible, horrible gas? And I was like, no. And oddly enough, I know eggs are no, like people see eggs as like something that makes your stomach terribly gassy and like stinky. <laughs> um, but to be honest with you, I didn't pass gas once since on this diet because I think that the combination of eggs and like carbohydrates might do that to you or eggs and vegetables of any kind. And in this, in this fast, all I had was the eggs, mayo, and mustard. There was nothing else. There was nothing else to create gas. The eggs themselves did not give me any gas at all. So that was a pretty cool side effect. But now that I'm getting back into normal food, that, that might be changing. <laughs> so did I get gas? Um, no, none, nada, zilch, which is fantastic. So I'm gonna show you um, day one, day two, day three weigh-ins to make it easier for you. I'm just going to do a compilation of day one, day two, day three, and you're going to see the results. Okay, so as you can see, on day one, I lost 1.2 pounds. Like when I weighed myself the second morning, I, I had lost 1.2 pounds. And on day three, um, which was yesterday morning, I, I lost 0.8 pounds. So it's like not even a pound, but close to it. And this morning, as you could see, like, wow, my final weigh-in, was 253.8 which is a grand total weight loss of 4.8 pounds in three days of eating deviled eggs that's it 4.8 i woke up and i'm like oh god please please let me lose enough weight because like i i didn't want to look like a crazy fool but I, I could not believe the results. I was actually like, wow, maybe I am in like a deep ketosis. And I think I am because I'm sweating a lot, which I think that means my metabolism's revving up because I feel hot. 
and um, I can't seem to cool myself down today. <laughs> So I must be in a real deep state of ketosis at this point. If I had a stick, a, ke a keto stick, I'd probably know if I was in ketosis. But you know, I'm also sweating a lot. It usually gives it away. And the fact that I lost like 2.8 pounds overnight, that's, that's a good sign that I am in ketosis, which is awesome. And I want to kind of keep my body in ketosis. So it's like a jump start, so that I can get back on my regular keto uh, lifestyle, which is vegetables and meats and healthy fats so yeah I'm, I'm pretty excited about this three-day um, deviled egg fast I'm really excited that it worked for me and by no means am I telling you to try it I just wanted to do an experiment for you guys to just show you that eggs are not fattening that you actually can lose weight by eating more eggs in your diet they fill you more they satiate you um, I noticed that even if I'm doing a regular keto diet, just eating my normal, you know, proteins and vegetables, if I incorporate eggs into my diet, I do have less hunger, a lot less hunger. So that's a great thing. But anyway, I thank you so much for joining me. Thank you so, so much to all my new subscribers. Thank you to all of my subscribers. And if you're not subscribed, subscribe to my channel so you can see everything that I'm up to. I'm always up to something crazy, you know. And if there's anything that you have, any ideas, please give them to me, you know, keep them coming. Let me know in the comment section if you've tried the egg fast. You know, I wanna, I wanna converse with you guys. So please don't be ashamed to let me know what's going on in your life. Like, have you tried dieting? Are you dieting now? Um, you know, weight loss and trying to get better health, not just through weight loss, but through eating better and trying to exercise more, be more heart healthy. I think that, you know, it is a struggle for some of us that um, are out of shape and not feeling well, uh, have some health issues, all kinds of things can, can counteract you from doing the right things for your body. And most of the time it's this, you know, your mind, if you don't love yourself enough, sometimes you just don't have that drive to take care of your body. And so I'm here to uh, support you and um, I want you to know that I wish nothing but the best for you. I pray for you guys. I love you guys. I appreciate all of you. So anyway, with me blabbing away, I'm going to say God bless you and whatever you do, do it well.